Hello, Fountain Pen World. I wanted to take a minute or five to give everyone a quick overview of the upcoming Philly Pen Show. So without further ado, ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, children of all ages, get ready for this weekend's grand event. The Philadelphia Pen Show will be at the Westin Hotel in the center of Philadelphia, January 23rd and 24th. The show runs Saturday from 10 a.m. to 5 p.m. and Sunday from 10 a.m. to 4 p.m. VIP pass holders get in at 8 a.m. both days. Tickets are $10 online before the show or $15 at the door, and tickets are good for both days. VIP pass is $25 online before the show or $30 during the show. That's right. January 23rd and 24th, more than 50 vendors will be displaying a huge selection of both modern and vintage pens, along with thousands of inks, stockpiles of paper from notebooks to journals to the infamous Toma River paper. As well, you will find a large variety of cases to store your passion safely. So make your shopping list and get ready. Honestly, make a list of pens to try and things you want to do as time flies when you're playing with pens. With Franklin Kristoff being the major sponsor, you will see the largest display of prototype pens they have ever brought to a show. On top of that, they have a limited edition ink for the show only. Introducing Franklin Green. Only 100 bottles have been made for the show, so don't hesitate to buy it if you want it. But wait, there's more. They are also introducing a variety of acrylic pens for the show. Make sure you stop by and see those special colors. Some of your favorite vendors and friends will be attending there with their best. Brian and Lisa Anderson of Anderson Pens will have the largest showing ever. Anderson Avenue will be wide open for business. Susan Worth with her table of flexies is not to be missed. Be sure to chat it up as she is a wealth of knowledge. Ryan Krusak will have a full showing of his amazing artistry and a few very special pens made for the show. Bert of Bertram's Inkwell showing a wide range of vintage and modern pens. Make sure you stop by and give his hand a shake. He's always good to chat with. New York City's iconic Fountain Pen Hospital will be in attendance also with a fine showing of vintage and modern, as well as some of their store-exclusive inks. We also have Kenro, the U.S. importer for Aurora, Montegrappa, and Omas. They will be showing off the latest pens, so make sure you stop by. Vintage Pens will have extra representation with the likes of Paul Arano, Rick Kranz, and New York City Pens, just to name a few. Of course, if you need a quick pick-me-up, stop and see Chef Brandon Lee of Modern Chocolatier for some handcrafted and flavor-blended chocolate. Also, don't forget to see the nib grinder, Mark Bacchus. If you need a nib adjusted or just want to turn that broad nib into an exceptional and expressive stub, this is the guy to see. Make sure to check the website for the overwhelming list of vendors from all across the country that will converge this weekend to help you find and love what you're looking for. Seminars all weekend will be going on. You don't want to miss these opportunities, so be sure to buy tickets for them online. There may be openings the day of the show, but you need to confirm once you are there. A short list of them, the history of Esterbrook with the one and only Brian Anderson, Beginner Italic Calligraphy with Deborah Basil. Pen Design and Production in the USA with Scott Franklin and Dan Simons. Spencerian First Strokes for Beginners with Michael Ward. Amazing. Resack and Esterbrook with Brian Anderson. See the site for details, but you actually get to restack, resack and Esterbrook with him. Cursive Handwriting Workshop with Deborah Basil. And Pens for Kids workshop will also be done on Sunday. Sunday also there is a second Spencerian class by Michael Ward called Second Strokes. Can't stress it enough. Make sure you see the website for all the details, times, and days. And again, to register for those classes. Raffles will be ongoing throughout the show. If you pre-order your tickets online before 7 p.m. Friday, January 22nd, you're automatically entered to win a 16-piece, four-tier box of hand-forged chocolates from the Modern Chocolatier. If you won, you will be notified when you check in at the registration table. Frank from Federalist Pens is donating a Laban Elegant Model Fountain Pen with crystal trim to be raffled off one day, and Jeff Powers Pens. Jeff of Powers Pens, who is unable to attend this year, will be donating a Pelican M400 to be raveled off as well. Franklin Kristoff has donated a bottle of the Philadelphia Pen Show only 
limited edition Franklin Green to be raffled off every hour of the show. That's right. Every hour of the show, a bottle will be raffled off. And of course, everyone who attends the show will receive a limited edition Philadelphia Pen Show Fountain Pen Day bookmark. I'll be there to greet everyone as you enter, right by Pen World and the registration table. Feel free to hang out and chat pens or just ask questions. I'm looking forward to meeting everyone. Of course, last but not least, Saturday night as the show ends at 5, the fun will continue with a meet and greet in the room right next door. You can register online for this and it's free. Just bring your pens, paper, ink, and join us to share your passion. There will be a pile of prizes to be raffled off at 6 p.m., including Monte Grappa Skull Journals, Omas Writing Pads, Omas 90th Anniversary Journals. Those were donated by Kenro. As well, Brian from Kenro has also reached out and acquired the new Grappa pen from Monte Grappa and will have it on display for everyone to see at the meet. This pen will not be raffled off, unfortunately. Also, we have to raffle off a special bottle of Waterman inspired blue ink. It is engraved with the Fountain Pen Day logo and Philadelphia 2016. This was donated by Van S. Pens, who also could not attend. The bar is right across from the room and we will bring in snacks as we can. Remember, this is a great opportunity to share with others who have a passion for pens just like you. Stay five minutes or stay five hours, but stop in and say hello. Make sure you share your pictures online with hashtag Philly Pen Show 2016 so we can all peek and see what you got and the good time you had. I'll see you all there this weekend.